Hello Sagittarius, how are you? I hope this finds you well. So we are going to be doing your you versus them reading and everything that you need to know, uh, whether it's about this reading, personal readings, Patreon, the tarot course, all that stuff is in the description box below for you. And we're gonna go ahead and get into your reading, taking a look at your energy and the energy of the person that you're dealing with or will be dealing with. All right, my loves. All right, Sagittarius, your energy. We have the Eight of Swords in the reverse. And at the bottom of the deck, we have the Chariot. Yeah, I feel like you guys are, it's it's not always easy, and I feel like you guys could have a lot on your plate at this time, but I do feel like you guys are starting to, to move forward, okay? I feel like there's somebody here that, you know, you're realizing that you're just not, you're not thinking about as much, it's not having as much of an effect on you. And I feel like you're like, you know what, I'm 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 ready to start moving forward here. And I feel like I feel like you are. I feel like that's the space that you're in right now. Got the page of cups. And the two of swords. Mm. You guys, there could be a younger water sign that is interested in you or that is showing you some attention. And I feel like even though you're, you know, feeling much better and moving forward from something from your past, I do feel like some of you guys are just not quite sure if you're ready to open up to uh, this. It doesn't have to be a water sign. Um, it's coming through that way, but it is a general reading. Um, and it doesn't even have to be somebody that's younger than you. Although for some of you guys, I do feel like it is. Um, it could just be something that's very, very new. It's very flirty. It's very, you know, someone's definitely showing interest and attention. And I feel like you're a little bit indecisive. Like, I, I yeah, I'm, I'm not as hung up on this person, but am I really ready to jump into something else? You got the Page of Swords. Got the Page of Wands. You got a lot of pages here. So this could definitely be somebody who is younger than you. Um, just not, I don't know if you're quite I don't know if you're feeling if you're quite ready to take that step I do feel like there I do feel like there is somebody here that you are um that they have eyes on you you have eyes on them I feel like you're kind of curious why the two of swords why is why is it Sagittarius so hesitant nine of pentacles high priestess in the reverse yeah, some of you guys, I feel like when it came when it came to your last connection, um, I feel like some of you guys could have ignored the red flags or ignored your intuition, and now I feel like you're you're a little bit hesitant to step into anything. It's like I feel like you've worked really hard to get yourself to a good space, and it's like I still feel like you may not still fully trust yourself. Okay. Let's take a look at this person's energy towards you. Oh my, well, we have the devil. The queen of swords, the five of wands, and the knight of swords. Feeling this is separate energies here. We're gonna have to take a look at this. I feel like this devil energy, I'm gonna be honest, I feel like this devil energy is this younger person here, Sagittarius. And I do feel like it does feel very um, seductive and, and physical to me. Okay, so I do feel like this younger person, I'm not saying they don't have any other interests, but they have a lot of that interest. Okay, so somebody definitely wants to connect with you on that level. Um, but I do feel like this is a pat there's a past energy here as well. And I feel like it's coming up because I feel like almost as soon as 
as soon as you start kind of focusing your attention on this newer person, I do feel like this, this past energy comes back in and, and maybe they can kind of feel that or sense that for some of you guys, maybe they're like, they're observing as well. Um, Yeah, somebody's coming in very, somebody else is coming in very quickly towards you here, Sagittarius, wanting to have a conversation. Um, it's because I feel it's like they can almost sense that there's some kind of competition here. I feel like this conversation could kind of lead to some kind of um, argument right away. Now, for others of you, I would be careful for those of you where this person here is not a younger person, like... Um, I would be careful because for some of you guys, I do feel like this, there's this, somebody could be showing your interest, showing you interest, showing you a lot of attention. Um, some of you guys could work with this person. Um, but I do feel like this person could be married and is not being upfront about that. Uh, or they could say that they've been, they're going through a divorce and they haven't, or they're getting ready to get a divorce and they are not, um, and it could it could bring a lot of chaos and conflict into your life. This is this reading is getting kind of messy here. We have the Knight of Swords with the Five of Wands. You know, I feel like somebody could be reaching out wanting to have a conversation with you. So I would be careful because I do feel like either way, it looks like this is a very physical connection. I feel like you feel a very strong physical chemistry here. So I would be cautious opening up to it. Some of you guys, this high priestess in the reverse is you being asked not to ignore your intuition when it comes to a person. Okay. So for some of you guys, there could be a younger person who's just interested in you. And I feel like there's a past person that could be coming back towards you here. Um, it's almost like they can sense that your attention is somewhere else. And that person could try to create some conflict or, you know, just genuinely not be a great person to you. I feel like, you know, saying hurtful things or just getting upset when you don't want to conversate with them. Um, but for others of you where you're getting ready to be involved with somebody here, that's something that's very new, it's something very physical. This, Like I said, this could be somebody that you work with. It doesn't have to be them. Um, but it could be somebody who's still, they're still, they, they have not gotten their divorce. They're still, they are still married. I feel like it's going to bring, it could definitely bring some conflict here, some drama and chaos. Somebody could be reaching out to you wanting, like taking things out on you or wanting to question you about things, wanting to have a conversation with you about their your involvement with their significant other. Um, it definitely looks like this could get very, very messy. So kind of prepare yourself for that. And the thing is here is I feel like for some of you guys, um, this what you're trying to get over may not even be a past situation. Some of you guys were this person, you knew your intuition has been kind of telling you that there's something up with this person. Some of you guys could be thinking about releasing them or, you know, just not dealing with them because you could be observing things here and your intuition is going off and you're not feeling sure about it. Don't ignore your intuition about this person, okay? Um, now, if this is just a young person that is into you and giving you attention, I feel like the young person, I feel like that's fine, but it does look like it's gonna be very physical. It just looks like it's gonna be a very physical connection. Um, and if you're cool with that, then you're cool with that. So um, I would say that that person looks okay, but everything else here, it looks like it can bring a lot of chaos and conflict in. So definitely be careful, Sagittarius. Um, but that is what I have for you. I do hope that this helps. Now, if this resonates, uh, let me know. If it doesn't, that's okay. Just check out your other placements and everything that you need to know. You know, Patreon, Tarot course, personal readings, all that stuff's in the description box below for you. And if you want personal prayers for any reason at all, just put the little prayer emoji in the comments down below and then I will go through and pray for you. But if this is where we part, thank you guys so much for being here and I will see you next time.